What is up everyone, it's your boy Mad Panda. Today we're going to be playing God of War Part 2. So uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty interesting because we're finally facing the Hydra boss. And uh, I was editing last episode and uh, I realized that my voice wasn't uh, too loud during action scenes. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be kind of a struggle with this game because I can't really access the, the, you know, the music and stuff like that in the options menu. Um, you know directly from the menu itself. I have to literally back out the game Restart it and you know tap Yeah, uh, hopefully next episode the audio will be better, but uh, yeah, let's get it. I Talked for a bit too long right. uh, There's the save right there Yeah, with the God of War games with the early ones, I guess uh, It's kind of hard pinpointing the oh, I thought you were gonna be able to go there uh, it's kind of hard to pinpoint the uh, exact, you know, audio that you want. Let's go with the new one. Let's go with this one. Uh, with the audio that you want, you know, because uh, in other games you could always, you know, move them here and there, you know, however you want, you know, whatever will benefit, you know, the the, the game itself. But and here it's like overly loud, like really extreme. Get them away from the ship! Why won't they die? It's the giant one! He keeps healing the others! <laughs> no, I... God! We'll never get out of here! Doom! We're doomed! We're off! Oh, he's fucked. Yep. <laughs> If I remembered that we were gonna get the boss this early on, I probably would not have ended part one where I did and just continued. Which, uh, you know, that's the case, so I'm sorry, I apologize. Because it would have been nice to end that video with, you know, beating this, uh, Hydra, the main boss, but, uh, oh well. I'm like, it is what it is. <laughs> Let's get it. Oh shit. I mean, at least we're getting magic from, like, hurting these. So, uh, that shouldn't be that bad. Each one wants a piece of Kratos. I had to restart this portion right here because uh, the audio was really loud. So hopefully um, the audio is decent at this point. Kind of hopefully I'm praying that you guys could hear me. Because uh, during combat last episode, you know, I couldn't even hear myself when I was editing the, the video. Well, I think I remember there was like this thing there, like a spike that you were able to like drop on the on both hydra. Oh, I think you got weak on them. There you go. I mean, but it's still pretty cool that we can start off episode two with a boss fight, you know. There we go. Oh yeah. It's kind of funny. It was always kind of funny to me how, uh, and these boss le like levels, you know, that the main Hydra never really does anything. It just stands there like wagging its head around, you know, when its homeboys are literally getting wrecked by Kratos. Loki, I might make a ranking of like all the bosses in God of War, which one's my favorite. Might actually do that. Because I gotta say, like, pure spectacle and just pure nostalgia, I think uh, the Hydra has to be one of my favorites. But I think for me, I haven't played God of War 2 in a while, but for me, the Colossus of Rhodes will always be probably top 1 or 2. Like, that game was just something else. Wait, can I go over here? What's over here? 
Like, why can't I change my uh, camera? Like, hey. This game would definitely give uh, Heavy Rain a run for its money. Like, with the budget smashing and shit. Oh shit. I, I kind of forgot that Kratos is uh, basically a demigod that can die. I was like, I'm, I'm gonna die from the fall damage. I think the only way I could really stop it from pushing me off is uh, maybe if I use my uh, magic. Okay. Oh, it fucked me up. It landed on me. Uh, round three. Well, I could just stand behind this pillar. That would have uh, worked pretty well. Oh, he canceled it out. All right. I was not expecting that. Gotcha, bitch. Imagine getting tased in the mouth. That's literally what's happening to Hydra right here. Kind of looks like a fucked up puppy. Figure. What? It actually got me, dude? What the heck? I didn't press the buttons fast enough, shit. <laughs> you know, once in a while, it's always you know fun going back to, you know, one of these button smashers. And just enjoying yourself, you know? It's always fun to go back to the OG God of Wars. Except, uh... Chains of Olympus and, uh, Ascension. Arguably the worst uh, God of War game. And you know, I, I went to an open mind in that game. And uh, I was like, you know what? It might not be as bad as people thought. And uh, it's basically a rehash of God of War 3. A lot of the elements that they used. And uh, it, just, uh, it just feels really repetitive. Nothing really unique or new. Besides, you know, a couple boss fights like the Hecatonkeys that they did that a really good job. Do we have it now? Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh no, what? I'm not sure if I'm supposed to keep hitting it or if there's a uh, blue circle. On okay, there it is. Oh wow, freaking bamboozled me. And the fact that I don't have any more magic, oh there okay. There we go. That is awesome, bro. Holy shit. No! Okay, dude. The button smashing in this game is definitely no joke. I said this so many times, but it's not. Like, they barely any room to actually, you know, uh, hit the Hydra. Or my reflexes have uh, dwindled and dulled since uh, I last played a God of War game, like, what, six months ago? No, it wasn't six months ago, it was like... Four. Probably. I'm gonna be ready this time. That shot is freaking cool, man. You can't deny that. Brutality. And how can you forget this part right here? Help me! 
Even though this is disgusting, it's still pretty nostalgic going back into its mouth. <clears throat> Damn, I almost lost my voice there. I'm trying to talk all loud because of this freaking game. <laughs> this game is naturally loud, by the way. The gods you came back for me! I didn't come back for you. Like, the way I have the volume set up right now for the game itself is, uh, below, below its, you know, I guess you could say the actual, uh, game's volume. Like, it's below halfway. There we go. I don't know why it was so hard to get that out. Oh, is that the little, uh, tingling thing behind your mouth? What's it called? The uvula? The, I think it's called the uvula, right? Or not? I could be saying something else. I'm fucking up. You know, when we see a box of warbs up there, we, we gotta get it at all costs, you know? It's like, uh... It's like Captain America, at all costs. Oh, it's not red orbs, it's another Cyclops eye. Okay. Shit, I'll take that. Doesn't that increase, like, your health? I think you're able to take that zip line. I think it's a zip line. I think I, like, hit it wrong, accidentally. Uh, right here? There we go. See, I still remember this game. It's, like, engraved into my mind. Let us save one more time, just in case. Yeah, because I'm streaming this game, and, uh... I'm terrified that I would lose my save data. Jesus. Imagine that. And I think the room was that way? Yeah, it was that way. Right. Oh, I didn't mean to kill that dude. I thought he was an enemy. Dude, the freaking coast is clear. I don't know why he's still hiding there. Right. I mean, to be fair, there really isn't anywhere else to go. <laughs> isn't in the middle of the ocean? I mean, our little box is still there, so that's good. I thought I was going to you know, push it back. I'm talking about this one right here. Where the hell do they keep coming from? Jesus. Unless I'm going crazy. No, they definitely reappeared. Alright. Damn, that was a combo right there. Did you see that shit? They can punch me in an arrow. I'm pretty sure that was it. I'm pretty sure that was it. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Uh, let me see if there's a uh, sailor right here. I have to do this just in case. To get a bit of health. Or half my health right there. The game was really bad when it came to, uh, you know, keeping shit together, in a sense, you know? If that makes any sense? Like, uh... We upgraded the Blades of Chaos and Ascension all the way to the max, and they were all, like, jagged and shit. And then, like, ba they're basically new in every single, uh, God of War game, like, starting from zero. Like, it would've been nicer if, like, each game had, like, a different evolution to the Blades. You know, made them even worse or more jagged to the point where you were just freaking carrying, like, shards of freaking steel. That'd be hilarious, though. <laughs> Not for the game, though. <laughs> Slaughtered like animals, the victims lay before him, a reminder of his own past, a past he could never escape. His only solace was the sea, endlessly sailing from one harbor to the next in service to the gods of Olympus. All his hopes rested with them. 
For no matter how much wine he consumed or how many women he took to his bed, nothing on earth could rid him of the horrors that plagued his mind. <laughs> Athena! Ten years, Athena. I have faithfully served the gods for ten years. When will you relieve me of these nightmares? We request one final task of you, Kratos. Your greatest challenge awaits in Athens, where even now my brother Ares lays siege as we speak. Athens is on the verge of destruction. It is the will of Ares, my great city fall. Zeus has forbidden the gods from waging war on each other. That is why it must be you, Kratos. Only a mortal trained by a god has a chance at defeating Ares. And if I am able to do this, to kill a god, then the visions, they will end? Complete this final task, and the past that consumes you will be forgiven. Have faith, Kratos. The gods do not forget those who come to their aid. Leaving the rotting carcass of the Hydra behind, Kratos set sail once more. His greatest challenge and freedom from his growing madness lay before him in the ancient city of Athens. All right. Is there a save point here? I think you're able to get back in bed and get some uh, red orbs, which I'm going to do. It's a tradition at this point. Oh, he has a cyclops over here. <laughs> That's kind of cute. Uh, there's no red orbs there. Can I destroy the bed? I might be able to. All right, let's uh, Come back to bed. get back into the party. Come back I can't to bed, come back Kratos. to bed, Kratos. Come back to bed. Oh well, I guess I'm getting the red orbs somehow. Oh, you can't. Oh, you gotta hop on. You literally have to hop on. <laughs> These were always really tough. Ooh. And they made you uh, spin. There we go. That was hilarious to me. I'm kind of wondering. Hold up. I'm kind of wondering if you. No, I don't think you keep getting red orbs. I don't think you do. Because if we do, then I just found a way to break the game. You keep getting red orbs? What? Holy shit, I didn't even know that. They're like the big fat orbs, you know? Like, that's a lot. Kratos is gonna end up killing them, bro. Like, Jesus. I could literally farm red orbs. I think this is what I'm gonna do for the next hour. Just, you know, get some red orbs. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I think if there's no, uh, is there's nothing here. Is, is there like a safe point? Because if there is, I'm definitely coming back. And okay, there is a safe point. All right, yeah, I'm gonna be ending the video here. I'm gonna farm those red orbs a lot. I'm gonna see how many I can get. Maybe I could get like an entire upgrade. But uh, yeah, I did not know that. All right, that was pretty interesting. But uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.